This is Colin Help, and this is your audio tip of the week. In a recording scenario, we always want to make sure that whatever we're recording is the sound that we want. As a recording engineer, you want to, you want to be capturing the sound of the source and be as close to the sound of that source as possible. So the source needs to be a quality source. You know, if, we're, if you're dealing with a, you know, $30 guitar that, you know, doesn't stay in tune and, you know, just in general sounds bad, it's probably going to sound bad when you record it. So you need, you need to always make sure that you have a quality source in order to have a quality recording. The tuning of the guitar is, also, is, is extremely important in a recording. One of those things that gets very hard to fix after the fact. And then, you know, having new strings is, is good, but you don't want brand new strings. It's not a thing where you, you want to change those strings the morning before you're going to record or 30 minutes before you're going to record this thing. You know, the strings are going to stretch and they're just going to fall right out of tune. And so, you know, changing them in advance to where they've kind of gotten broken in, but they're not worn out. Um, so that, you know, they're going to sound good. They're going to be bright and chimey, but not but not uh, falling out of tune every every 30 seconds or whatever. And then on drums, you know, if you have fresh drum heads, the same kind of a thing, those are also going to stretch over time, over, you know, over playing. And so those want to be stretched in and broken in a little bit. And also the drum tuning is, is very important. So if, if a drum is out of tune, there's nothing, there's nothing here that we can do to fix the tuning of a drum after the fact. So if something's out of tune, we need to fix that source and tune that drum better. And so that needs to be addressed on the recording side versus, say, the mixing side of a project. For vocals, the most often used microphone is a large diaphragm condenser mic. And sometimes that's a tube mic and sometimes it's not. But a large diaphragm condenser mic is typically your, you know, sort of a, gonna get you the more warm, intimate vocal sound. So I need you.